Hey Dan, um, response here, part three of, I think it's part three of how to solve the four by four Rubik's Cube, um, more specifically on the parity issues. Um, whenever you have two corner switch, any two corner switch, whether it be the sides or the cross corners, um, what you can do to bypass the normal long algorithms that I found out is you can do the shortest parity algorithm that you have, which is two little r, two big u, two little r, two u star, two little r, and two little u, and then go ahead and proceed to resolve the cube. And this will put the corners back into the correct position that they need to be. Um, as you can see, it still leaves three of the corners unsolved, but they are in the correct position. So all you need to do is to do the the corner switch algorithm, and that basically solves both the parity issues with the shortest parity algorithm that you gave. So those of you that are having trouble remembering the long algorithms, just perform this. It doesn't matter on which side you do it from. Like if you had these two corners switched and you had it from the back side, the side, it doesn't matter. It flips around some weird corner and it ends up working out.